um, in, uh, in uh, Wisconsin. And um, they actually have a community gym, which was used to be a, uh, a large campus of a Catholic church that they bought back for pennies and the Catholics left. And, um, and they turned it into a gym, but the gym really is kind of like an ACO. Um, it has the primary care, mental health care, substance um, abuse um, care, peer support, and gym. <laughs> so it's, it's like this wellness <laughs> community that's an ACO. I mean, and, and um, uh, when, I, when I first saw it, I was like, this is so cool. Because a number of things happened. Is, is one, um, there was a reduction of stigma around going to the gym. Hey, I'm going to the gym. And this morning, when, when in fact you might be going to see your, your mental health provider, mm -hmm. but that might not be something that you would want to talk about. Mm -hmm. And nobody knows where that mental health provider is. I don't know how they find the person. Because again, if you know you're going to the room on the second floor next to the bathroom, that's a mental health person. <laughs> no, I don't, you know, the person doesn't really have an office in, in that way. You just kind of know who that person is and they go going with that person. So um, I, I think um, I like looking at other, other models to look for examples of how we can become un, unstuck yes. and, and maybe move, move forward with uh, some really uh, good examples. The other thing around um, primary care and um, medications within the primary care setting that I worry about is I hear the word treatment, but I think in primary care, treatment means medication. And within mental health and substance use, I don't believe treatment is uh, and medication are, um, the terms are interchangeable. Mm -hmm. um, and of course, mental health treatment and substance use uh, treatment is much broader. Mm -hmm. um, and if you're going in initially to primary care and receiving treatment within primary care and you get the med, then that's all you know, that's all you think is supposed to happen. Mm -hmm. um, so again, the education piece around, you know, what does it mean around mental health treatment as a very broad discussion that even a primary care could say, well, you know, maybe it's not meds first, maybe it's around some other, you know, social interactions or housing or blah, 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 blah. Mm -hmm. um, and, and not just the, as you say, if the transitions are difficult, yet you're going to refer someone, yeah, you know, until those transitions happen a lot smoother and a lot better, especially around therapeutic alliance. If I have an alliance with my primary care and then you're going to transition me, I don't like you anymore. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're, not, you're not my, you know, what, what happened to that alliance that was so important if we're, if we're doing all of this transitioning versus working as a really great team. Thank you so much. Rick, please.